Aiza ya. Bueno chicos, hasta aquí dejo la clase. Que sigan el teacher, por favor. Hello, hello. I'm sorry. <laughs> Something happened here. No problem, teacher. With the connection. All right, I do apologize for this inconvenience. All right, so eh, let's see this one. Okay, so, well, we have to start all over again. Do you remember the previous answers? What was intolerant? What was letter? A. A, all right, so letter A. There you go, excellent. So what about a uh, modest? Uh, what's letter H, I remember, yes. right? No. No. I. 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 Okay, very good. Excellent. Thank you. Temperamental. That's the one we were discussing. So what I. happens here? Yes, All right. That is... H. That's letter H, you said? H. Uh, so agree or disagree? Disagree. disagree. Okay. I disagree. Ah, okay. So which ones do you uh, consider it's the correct answer? I consider the... Right answer is G, a person who has unpredictable or irregular moves. Aha, uh -huh. unpredictable and irregular moves. I will go for that one too. Might be, might be G too. G? Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, egotistical. What is egotistical? C. It's letter C. Letter C. Can somebody read it? Yes. Uh, yeah. yes. Who can read it? Someone who expresses a very high opinion of himself or herself. Like me, 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 me. All right. So, yes, mm -hmm. in those examples, of course, right? So, um, letter C, right? Very good. Excellent. What about easygoing? H. Easygoing. H. Easygoing. H. H. Mm -hmm. No, no, no. No, there no. are eight. No. No, is letter F. A person letter who enjoys F. being with other people. Enjoy. Yeah. F. Letter F. All right. Yeah. So then you go on the next one. So then, uh, stingy. What's a stingy? Uh, Tacaño. Tacaño. Yeah, you understand that, right? So very good. So let's see, Tanya. that's correct. Okay, so that's gonna be what? What letter? Letter B. Letter B. Letter B, on generous, correct, all right. So the letter F is the first. <gasps> oh my yeah. goodness. Yes. So? That's why I said uh, letter H. Later H, who doesn't worry much or gets angry easily. Ah, you know what? You're right. It can be that one because Is it, it, says it doesn't get angry, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. Thank you. Thank you for the observation. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. Sorry. All right. So then we go to the next one. Number eight, unreliable. Someone you don't trust. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So what is it? E. 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 I. 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 Letter I. Letter I. Maybe. This oh. one? Oh, sorry. Oh, this one? E. oh, yes, yes. Letter E. Letter e. e. Okay. e. Yeah. And the last okay. one? D. Letter D. Later, D. D as in David. All right, excellent. So, thank you very much. And now, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, so we are going to verify right here. Um, let's see. E. Negative or positive? Negative. 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 Very good. Negative or positive? Positive. Very good. Negative or positive? Negative. What about egotistical? Negative. Easy going. Positive. 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 Negative. 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 Very negative. Very negative, he said. All right. Depends. Uh, well, it depends. All right. Unreliable, definitely <laughs> negative. 
Oh, all right. Excellent. Thank you very much. All right. Now we're going to uh, finish the activity right here. So do you have any questions? No questions? Okay. No, no for the moment. No problem. So let's just continue with this one here. Okay. So let's see. Let's just continue with this one. All right. So and uh, everybody here, we are going to uh, continue with those activities. Let's go with the activity uh, letter A there. All right, so I need a volunteer who can help me with this one. Who's my volunteer, please? For reading, for reading, 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 the letter A. Thank you, Alicia. Go ahead. Um, a, what is the idea? What is ideal parent, friend, or partner like? What is one quality it should have and one quality it should have it, it should, should not have? have. Mm -hmm. Complete the chart. Thank you very much. All right. So this is actually what I want you to discuss right now in with your partners, right? So uh, for this one, I am going to send you to the breakout rooms, but before I'm going to uh, help you with this one here. All right, so then you can give your own ideas. So, for example, uh, we are going to describe the ideal parent. What's a parent, my friends? El padre. Uh -huh. El padre o la madre. O el, no, your no, padre no, no. is in general, right? So, general. el padre ideal. So, what will be a quality this person should be? So, we will go here and say, for example, uh, let's see here, like this one. What happened? What I did thought I, I should be uh, support. One second. Support okay. Person. Yes. All right. So you can say, for example, here, this, excuse me, this person should be, um, what do you say? Support. support. Like this one? That's how you write it? Yes. No, with two P. Aha. Uh -huh. I was just checking. Supportive person, all right? And this person should not be. Uh -huh. Temperamental. <laughs> That's not possible, all right? Yes. So, <laughs> should not Egoistic. be. Egoistic. Egoistic, temperamental. All right, the one you prefer. Remember, there is, there is no correct or incorrect answer. It's your opinion, right? So, and your opinion doesn't have to be the same as mine or somebody else's opinion, right? Let's talk about friends right now. Friends, friends, friends. This person should be, uh huh. Is he going? Should be, is he going? Is he going? Okay, very good. And then like, you go on this confident, one. Confident person. Loyal, trustful, right? Very good. And this person shouldn't be self available. Uh -huh. Very good. L liar. Should not be selfish shouldn't be selfish and all the the adjectives you mentioned there remember that to uh, to talk about negatives so or like shouldn't like it's the contraction of should not all right so take that into consideration for the test as well all right so um and then the idea partner what is this partner we're talking about a relationship right so mm -hmm. The ideal partner. Let's see. What well, should be the ideal the ideal partner? The, this person should be faithful. Yes, this person should be faithful. Should be comprehend comprehensive. Comprehensive, lovely. Um, what else? Mm -hmm. This person should know about cooking, right? So anything. Respect. This person shouldn't be intolerable. Intolerant, you mean? Intolerant, intolerant yes. Sorry. Right, so. Should not be stingy. Stingy, <laughs> right? So yes, <laughs> of course, right? This person <laughs> shouldn't be uh, stingy, all right? I'm just going to write that one, stingy. All right. Oh, my goodness. Okay, excellent. So, 
Then let's just go ahead and see this one. All right. I already gave you uh, the examples based on what you guys were saying. And now it's your opportunity to practice this with your classmates in the breakout rooms. Okay. So we're going to go to the breakout rooms for a moment and you're going to discuss this with your partners. So for example, A, hey, hey, Alicia, A, hey, Milagro. So what's your uh, ideal parent? Ah, my ideal parent should be supportive, uh, but this person shouldn't be temperamental. So then you start sharing your opinions with your partners. Is that okay? Do you understand that? Is it clear? Yes, yes sir. Great. Yes. Let's just go to join the breakout rooms here. Okay. All right. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Please join the rooms, my friends. Okay, let me stop sharing this one. To say disrespectful, like respect Love. even the, the different decisions to each other, even if you don't like, you have to respect that for your partner. Okay. Oh my neck, my goodness, Mary. So you have a nice fluency. Ah, uh, yeah, kind, kind of. <laughs> <laughs> Very humble, by you know, from you, but yeah. You, the, the explanation you were given is very fluent. I like it. Thank you. You're going to be a volunteer. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no worries. No worries. What about uh, Carolina and Ingrid? Did you already participate? Yes. Yes. Yeah, all right. So you finished yeah. all the things here? Yes. Uh, we, we were at the part of the partners. We. We uh -huh. still, we haven't do the part of the parents and... Uh -huh. Okay, I'm sorry. Please continue. I will be here, okay? Okay.
Nick is a friend. Ah, the friend, yeah. 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 A friend and, and mm -hmm. parent. Yeah. This person should be loyal. For me, this person needs to be empathic. Em empath empathic. Sympathetic. Empathetic. Empathetic, yeah. Sympathetic. Loyal, sympathetic, comprehensive, yeah, um, supportive, supportive, a friend, a good listener too, good yeah. listener, uh, a confident, why they shouldn't be. Um, probably like unreliable. They shouldn't be yeah. unreliable, and uh, a friend shouldn't be selfish. Shouldn't be a liar. Um, stinging. Stingy. Or, All right. Mm -hmm. uh, criticize you for the things that you do. Too. They shouldn't criticize you. Okay, good. So, girls, I will go to another room to see how your partners are doing. And if you need help, I'll be here, all right? Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you. All right. What about... We should have a, a good relationship with, with a father for, for that situation. Mm -hmm. Okay. So you have questions? You need help, or you finished? Uh, we're on the way. Okay, I'm gonna stay here. I'm gonna listen to you. Okay, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. So I raised up with with my mother and with two with my two sisters. Yes, but I never have a a relationship with with the father or. I never has a, a presence of, of a father in my life. But um, I am a father, and as a father, I think that one of the attributes uh, the father needs to need to have is be comprehensive, uh, has a sensitivity, confidence, and other other things. Okay. What about the rest? Margarita, Carla? Hello. Um, yeah. For example, uh, the partner should be a optimistic person mm -hmm. because it's really important and a hard work, hardworking person. And it's really important for me uh, that my boyfriend or husband uh, should be a uh, support for me and uh, since a humble, humble person. Okay, very good. What about Carla? Oh, Carla is not here. All right. Okay, so we can continue with the next section, all right? I will go to a different room right now, but if you have questions or you need my help, you can let me know, okay? Okay. okay. Thank you. You can have it all in the same person. Yeah, yes, yes, yes. But okay, it, it, it's, it's very, very hard. In this, uh -huh. It's very hard. Okay. Uh -huh. Thank you. Thank you, Milagro. It's time? Uh, we have to come I, back I to the know. main. I don't no? know. No, I don't know. No, yet. You can keep practicing.
you, you, you still have time, so you can continue practicing, no worries. It's, it's always tired, my, my day. Mm -hmm. And you, and uh, tell me, please, what is your, what, um, what is the word in the, in the, in this moment? The word in this moment? Yeah. What I don't is, know. No? I don't know um, how is no, the word no. in this moment. Okay. Um, Excuse me, excuse me. I I I I mm, I guess you're talking about her job. Job, yeah. About my yeah. job? Yeah. How is my job? Yes. What what uh, um yeah. Okay. Um uh, how are you in, in your in your day in your day? How was your in day you job? mean? Oh, okay. How are you? My day? Days? Yeah. Well, my day is really, really tired, really heavy because here in the border, um, every day are trying to release new projects about free trade areas, about, um, I don't know how, how, how can I say, facilitation de comercio. Mm, uh, but, uh, uh -huh. free trade area they here in the border always are trying to release projects about that topic and about integrity they are asking us about a lot about integrity they want um all the employees uh be integral persons very honest and that we attend to others to the custom customers awesome. in the right way uh -huh. all right so you said like facilitas facilitation they can sorry the commercial free trade areas i guess yeah uh -huh. that's a topic. Like free trade areas yeah free trade mm -hmm. areas right mm -hmm. okay mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you. they don't it. want they don't want the customers to stay here in the border a lot of time two hours or three no they just want that the the custom come in and finish the operation in three minutes so we had to hurry to check Turn the documents in, uh, uh, yeah check the documents in just in one minute and then uh complete all the process in three minutes okay mm -hmm. okay so, well, in this moment the the tie up <laughs> okay the tie up okay okay bye bye then. Welcome back, everybody. All right, so we are going to uh, share some opinions here. All right, so you got to be ready for this one. And uh, I would like to see who's going to be my first volunteer. Volunteer, volunteer, volunteer. Yes, 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 yes. Ah, come on, everybody, just to share your, um, you know, your thoughts about this. Okay. Uh -huh. Who's my first volunteer? volunteers oh thank you robert all right so i'm going to be asking you for the three things there like you know this person should be and this person shouldn't be so for you the ideal pattern how should the ideal pattern be your microphone roberto sorry okay. no problem uh-huh i think the my, my ideal parent should be a person that is uh, 
supportive with the with the kids. Okay, very good, excellent. And like this person shouldn't be. Uh, shouldn't be temperamental for me. Temperamental. All right, very good, excellent. Thank you. What about the ideal friend? My ideal friend should be uh, sociable. Okay. And shouldn't be unreliable. All right, very good. And what about the ideal partner? My ideal par partner should be modest and shouldn't be uh, temperamental too or egotistical. Egotistical, yeah, right. Well, That's no. Yeah, 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 like that one. All right, got it. Thank you, my friend, for sharing your information, right? So now I would like to listen to somebody else. Thank you, Roberto. Good job. All right, so anybody else? Yes. Who's at me? Patricia. Oh, Evis. All right. Go ahead. Tell I me about your idea. Ideal... Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. I think that the, the ideal parent should be loving and shouldn't be stinky. <laughs> the ideal friend should be reliable, uh -huh. but shouldn't be. Hippo hi hypocrite. Hypocrite. There yes. is the correct pronunciation. Hypocrite. Hypocrite. The mm -hmm. ideal, okay. The ideal partner should be easygoing and shouldn't be. I'm I'm angry. Mm -hmm. Angry. All right. And that's the ideal partner you said. Angry. Angry. No angry. Yeah. Of course, nobody yes. would like to have any anybody who's angry, angry. right? Of course, of course, of yes. course. All right. Thank you. Then uh, let's just go on this one. What about the next volunteer? Who's going to be my next volunteer? Rene. All right, Rene, please share your thoughts. Please, please, please. Okay. For me, the ideal pairing should be offer support, provisional, or be helpful person and should not be punishment or abusive. Mm -hmm. All and right. my ideal my ideal friend ideal. should be solidary, sincere. sincere. Okay. Okay. And should not know selfish or angry. Or angry. All right. Very good. Excellent. Okay. So Thank you, my friend. Thank you, thank you. Anybody else who would like to share their opinion about this? Just one more, the last one. Please, please, please. Yes. Oh, come on, don't be shy, people. You can do it, all right? Let's see, let's see. Carolina, thank you, Carolina. I appreciate it. Well, for me, my ideal, my ideal parent should be comprehensive and shouldn't be selfish. selfish. Uh, uh -huh. My ideal partner should be smart and shouldn't be stingy. <laughs> oh, you're the one ideal, saying that one. All right. My, my ideal friend should be loyal and shouldn't be angry all right excellent thank you thank you thank you thank you all right and then we go on this one right here so let's see thank you my friends all right so now let's just move here to the next activity that we are going to be performing tonight all right all right one second okay it's ready okay everybody let me share this screen again where is it here it is and now we are going to work in a listening activity, okay? But um, I want you to, like, if it is possible for you, take a screenshot of the activities I have here for you. Just three questions only. It's very simple. Uh, can someone do me a favor, take the, take the screenshot and send it to the WhatsApp group so you can have it? Because I will have to remove, I mean, I will have to stop sharing the screen to share the audio. So can someone do me that favor? Please, 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 please send it to the group. 
Thank you. Thank you, thank you. All right, excellent. So now I'm going to go here with the new sharing. Where is it? All right. We are going to listen to the conversation and then you're going to choose the correct answer from question one, two, and three. It's very simple. Let's see. Please confirm with reactions if you can listen to this. So, have you seen Andrea lately? Yeah, I see her once in a while. How's she doing? I've been meaning to call her. Well, to be honest, she's kind of been getting on my nerves lately. What do you mean? Excuse me, were you able to listen to that? What? Were you able to listen to the conversation or not? Yes. Yes, yes, I can. yes, yes, oh, yes. Okay. I'm sorry. Let me just start again. Okay. So, have you seen Andrea lately? Yeah, I see her once in a while. How's she doing? I've been meaning to call her. Well, to be honest, she's kind of been getting on my nerves lately. What do you mean? She's changed a lot since we've started college. She talks about herself all the time, and she always manages to mention how good she is at everything she does. Really? That would be annoying. It is. You know, she asked me to be roommates with her next semester, but I don't think I want to live with her. She used to be really generous, but now she's just the opposite. And it's not just with money, but her time as well. Well, college can be stressful. You two are good friends. Maybe you need to talk more. Are you going to James's party on Saturday? Of course. James always gives the best parties, and there are always lots of interesting new people to meet. It's true. I don't know where he manages to find them all. Well, you know what he's like. He makes friends very easily. He really likes talking to people, and he loves inviting people over. Uh-huh. He invited me for dinner last Saturday. What a feast. Yeah, he's a great cook, too. After dinner, I offered to help clean up and he told me not to worry about it. He said he'd take care of it later. He was like, it's nothing, no big deal. Yep, that sounds like James. Have you met the new apartment manager? Mr. Johnson? Yeah, I met him last week. He's a little strange. Yeah, he is. I'm not sure I like him. He's hard to predict. Sometimes he's pretty cheerful and talkative, and the next day he doesn't even say hello. I think he must have personal problems or something. I think you're right. And have you noticed that half the time when he says he's going to do something, he never actually does it? He told me three times he'd come to fix the light in my kitchen, and he still hasn't done it. All right, excellent. So were you able to catch the answers? Or do you want me to repeat the audio one more time? One more time, teacher, please. Done, done, done. I'm done. I'm done. All right. So, well, I will. I consider I will repeat it just one more time for the ones who didn't catch all the answers, and that will be the last one. Okay. Okay. So, and if you finish, you can just double check the answers. Okay. So, have you seen Andrea lately? Yeah, I see her once in a while. How's she doing? I've been meaning to call her. Well, to be honest, she's kind of been getting on my nerves lately. What do you mean? She's changed a lot since we've started college. She talks about herself all the time, and she always manages to mention how good she is at everything she does. Really? That would be annoying. It is. You know... She asked me to be roommates with her next semester, but I don't think I want to live with her. She used to be really generous, but now she's just the opposite. And it's not just with money, but her time as well. Well, college can be stressful. You two are good friends. Maybe you need to talk more. Are you going to James's party on Saturday? Of course. James always gives the best parties. And there are always lots of interesting new people to meet. It's true. I don't know where he manages to find them all. Well, you know what he's like. He makes friends very easily. He really likes talking to people. 
And he loves inviting people over. Uh huh. He invited me for dinner last Saturday. What a feast! Yeah, he's a great cook too. After dinner, I offered to help clean up, and he told me not to worry about it. He said he'd take care of it later. He was like, "It's nothing, no big deal." Yep, that sounds like James. Have you met the new apartment manager, Mr. Johnson? Yeah, I met him last week. He's a little strange. Yeah, he is. I'm not sure I like him. He's hard to predict. Sometimes he's pretty cheerful and talkative, and the next day he doesn't even say hello. I think he must have personal problems or something. I think you're right. And have you noticed that half the time when he says he's going to do something, he never actually does it? He told me three times he'd come to fix the light in my kitchen, and he still hasn't done it. Yeah. All right, excellent. So let's see. Let's just go back to the previous one here. And I need a volunteer who can help me read in question number one and tell me the answer. Thank you, Roberto. Go ahead. Okay, mm -hmm. number one. Which statement best describes Andrea? Uh, is Andrea someone who is egotistical and stingy? It's egotistical and stingy, all right? Is yes. that correct, people? Yes. yes. That's correct. Thank you very much for Thank sharing you. that, all right? And uh, what about the volunteer for the number two? Oh, Alicia, all right? Go ahead. Okay, number two. Which statement best describes James? Mm -hmm. James is someone who is sociable and easygoing. All right, excellent. Thank you very much. Is that correct, people? Would you agree with that one? Yes, I it is. Did. Yes. Thank you. All right. And the last one, number three, who's going to be my volunteer for that one? Yes, yes, yes. Thank you, Norma. Go ahead. Which statement best describe Mr. Johnson? Mr. Johnson is someone who is temperamental and Unreliable. Reliable. Unreliable. <laughs> thank you very much in this one. All right. Very good. Excellent. So thank you guys. Right. Was it difficult for you to understand the listening section there? No. Not at all. No. Not at all. All right. Well, very good. Excellent. So, okay. We are going to move to the last activity, which is super simple. But before I do that, let me just check attendance quickly here. All right. So Alicia Choto. Uh, present teacher. Thank you. Carlos Asensio. Uh, no. All right. So, Carolina Paz. Present teacher. Thank you. Cesar Fernandez. Right here. Thank you. Senia Chicas. Senia. Not here. All right. George Anthony. Present. Thank you. Ingrid Flores. Here, teacher. Thank you. Irma Segura. All right. No. All right. Ibis e Ramirez. Present. Thank you. All right. So um, let's see here. Joanna Michelle Satino. Joanna, Joanna. No. All right. So let's see, Josue Alejandro. Jose Present Alejandro, teacher. Sorry. Present um, teacher. Thank you, Juan David. Present teacher. Thank you, Present. Carla Melissa. Present. All right, so uh, Kimberly Rachel. Lucia Elena. Thank you, Margarita Vigail. Present. Marin eh, Carranza. Present teacher. Thank you, Milagro Jimenez. I'm here, sir. Thank you, Mirna Landos. In chat, eh, I uh, Jeanette, right? have a problem with connection. Thank you very much for the reminder. All right, so eh, Monica Reyes. Yeah. 
Yes, teacher. Okay, Nelson Seron. Okay, Nelson. Eh, okay, sorry, Norma Elizabeth. Eh, Nelson, Nelson says he's present in the chat. Yes, I saw it. Thank you very much for also reminding me that. Um, Patricia Garcia. Present. So thank you, Patricia. All right, so Patricia Castellanos. Here I am, teacher. Hello, Patricia. I didn't see you at the beginning of the class. <laughs> okay, I'm here. All right, so uh, René Alberto. I think, I think he put it in the chat too that he is present, I think. Let me see. Yes, René Alberto but, Salinas. Oh, yeah, but, that's true. But, but he can listen. Okay, got it. Uh, Ronald Alexis. I'm here to share. Me Roberto Josué, sorry. All right, so in uh, uh, Sandra Elizabeth. Present teacher. And Stephanie Quintanilla. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, so yeah, we are about to finish. Just one more minute here. All right, so in, I just want one or two volunteers who can actually go with this one right here. All right, so take a look. This one. Describe your favorite person, right? Who's your favorite person in your life? Your mother, your father, your friend, your brother, your sister, your boyfriend, girlfriend. Who's your favorite person? And of course, describe the person using the vocabulary we just practiced tonight, right? Is he going sociable or stingy? I don't know. All right, etc. So who can help me with that one? Remember, this is our last activity, so then we can go. All right. So All right. Who's gonna help us with that? Mm -hmm. Just one person, please. So who is it? Hello, hello. Hello. Who is going to help me to describe that person? Ah, come on guys, you are not shy. Oh, thank you, Carolina. Tell us, who's your favorite person? My son. Jose. Okay. Tell uh, me about Jose, him. Uh, Josue is a man who's uh, 35 years old and uh, he's clever, he's uh, lovely and um, a little a little angry sometimes. Oh my God. Uh, he's so, so sociable and easy going. That's my son. Oh my God. All right. Thank, Thank you very you. much. That was so cute. A mother talking about uh the song right so good 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 thank you i love it all right and the last one is going to be roberto go ahead and talk about your favorite person okay in my case is my mother okay uh, she is a teacher and for little kids okay uh, she is very tolerant with the kids with all my brothers and me uh, she is very modest and she should she's very polite she's very reliable with all all of us all right and that's it i'm very supportive supportive all right awesome 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 thank you my friend for that one all right well i don't know if anybody else wants to share about your favorite person before we leave no <laughs> She's like, no, let's go. Let's go to sleep right now. <laughs> All right, so. <laughs> no worries. No worries. All right. So we are going to stop right here. I just want to say thank you very much for joining the class on time, for participating in the activities, and of course, for working on the platform as well. So I will see you tomorrow, my friends. Have a good night, everybody. Good night. Good night. Good night. Bye. Bye. Oh.